kind of the game is this? So I just hit three hours, but I'm kind of slow because I chat a lot. I'm chatty, but I think, where are we, you guys? We're on like day three? Not very far. <laughs> Come on, funky frog, give me some credit. Very slow building, really, I wouldn't have guessed that. It feels like it's going so fast. Literally, like, the speed at which I'm getting so close to Yuri, I thought we were, like, more than halfway done. Is that not the case? Spoiler free, but is that, is that not the case? Am I not even a fraction of the way through? <laughs> Nowhere near time. Really? Wow, alrighty. Aha! <laughs> Approaching half whimsical dragon. Thank you. I'm so happy. <laughs> even if even if that's a little bit of an exaggeration, I'm relieved. I'm sure your cupcakes are gonna be the best. Honestly, any club that gives out free cupcakes is gonna get a lot of new members. There's still a lot to go. Oh, jeez, Louise. Four roots and two endings. Well, right now I'm just going for Yuri. So as far as going through Yuri's route goes, am I doing well? Am I doing a good job? I'm trying my best, I promise. sounds mean. I guess so. <laughs> You're flirting? What? Yeah, you dang right that better be sarcastic. My flirting is top tier. We gonna give her a phone number? We gonna get a phone number? Yes, we are. Just give me your Twitch. Give me your Twitch handle. <laughs> You're flirting is over 9,000! Thank you, Funky Frog. That's the positivity I like to hear. <laughs> hey, girl, what's your MySpace page? <laughs> Whimsical. That's amazing. What's your MySpace page? I miss MySpace. There wasn't so much drama on MySpace. This game was set in 2007. Well, now you know. She wants to come to my house. See what I mean? This is going so fast. Wait, does she have a bad home life? Now I'm nervous. Gotta go, don't know if I'll be back in time. Thank you, Taco, Takoyaki. Have a good rest of your day. Super appreciate you hanging out. I'm so old, I picked up girls on MSN. <laughs> ara, ara. Have a wonderful day, Taco. Thank you for your redeem. We are gonna make a very, well, we're either gonna make a really productive team or we're gonna be super unproductive because I'm gonna flirt with her the entire time. Oh, come on, don't cheap out with a response like that. I chose you because you're beautiful. <laughs> choose you because I want to spend more time with you. I want to get to know you. I want to. That's all there is to it. Even though there's a little more to it. She's 
so sweet. Beautiful. Couldn't be more <laughs> You're right, I gotta dust off my uh, pickup line book from yesterday. I can't believe this! <laughs> We're like skipping down the street. I can't believe this! Girls coming to my house! Like saying she shoots through the roof. Now we're gonna panic. Do we live with our parents? This is a chance. See, he's so focused. He's so hyper focused on getting a girlfriend. What you're to like this one? <laughs> Jesus Christ! Oh my God! Foster check, thank you. The more I get embarrassed, like, flirting with girls, the more I slouch in my chair. I noticed that. Do we- is it a spoiler if I ask, do we live with our parents? What is our home like? An intimate person in general? <laughs> what does that even mean? Oh, well, Hydrate, thank you. I was so focused on sitting up. I don't think we get to see your home. Lame. I wanted to see our room. I'm always curious how these like lame main characters live. Hello, Cloud Mucky. Welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for the follow! Cloud Mucky, welcome to the crew! Thanks for being here for Doki Dokis! Oh, that emote is so cute! Holy cow! No parents in anime? <laughs> yeah, right? They're either absent parents or dead parents. <laughs> It's not really okay, but hey, we we get a girlfriend. <laughs> Dead while I went dark. It's no, I'm not even being dark. That's true. Like every single anime, they're like, yeah, my parents died. I live by myself. Your avatar is very cool. Thank you. I appreciate that. You're so sweet. How is your day going, Cloud? Can I call you Cloud, or would you like me to call you Muckin? <laughs> the house is quiet. We're just barging on in. Please don't walk in on her crying, dude. I can't handle. I feel bad enough, like, <laughs> that I made her feel bad. Everyone calls me Cloud. All right, I love that name. Cloud it is. Every Disney princess is an orphan, <laughs> right? Except for Ariel, whose dad just yells at her all the time. Okay, she's not crying. I'm relieved. Ah, yeah, yeah. You're welcome. Now I'm like looking around her room like, what's going on here? We got a plant? We got clothes lying everywhere? A cow? Speaking of crying, Sayuri is my favorite. Wow, Sayuri gang, it really is building up here. That's what everybody keeps saying, Sayuri's best girl. <laughs> messy, is it's, it's really not that messy. If this is what messy means, I'm in trouble. <laughs> You came over more often, wouldn't be such a mess. Oh, that hurts my heart. Natsuki is best. Oh, Cloud, you're the first to mention Natsuki. Nice. I award Natsuki the best smile award. Because I was so messy, she can't see her carpet. Joke's on you. I don't have a carpet. So, ha. 
And my house is not actually that messy. <laughs> Please step on me. All five feet of her. <laughs> you live like this. Oh god. Helping her online. Ooh, the age of technology. More silence between us. That's cute. Say we could step on me together. It's so hurt. <laughs> That's a good one. They might crack your back. Cute pocket size. Something's wrong, you can't hide it from me. I am your friend. I hate this. I hate this. I really truly hate this. No, stop it. <laughs> Would this have happened if I walked home? If I told her I want to walk home with her? They both would sew a lot of organ damage if you have a step on me fetish. <laughs> Could be, unless you know the right places to step. Stop this. This is torture. I'm getting punished for being so selfish. Yeah, I'm getting punished for being so not in love with you. <laughs> Oh, man. Don't, don't laugh like that. That's sad. She's just like shaking her. What are you saying? <laughs> you could stand on each other's shoulders. They might be taller than me. Right? Don't cry. I know I'm gonna cry too. This sucks. I hate this. Literally, like, you kind of already know what the problem is, so just forcing her to say it, I don't think is very helpful. Or healthy. Really put me in a trap. Girls crying hurts me. <laughs> yeah, it hurts me too. Oh, man. Yeah, this game's getting deep. English not my first language. Oh, that's okay, Cloud. Don't even worry about it. If you don't mind, what language do you speak? Oh God, here it comes. I'm not ready for this. Turkish, oh wow, that's so cool. Your English is great to me. Played it three times. Oh man. I've had really bad depression my whole life. <gasps> my God. Why do you think I'm late to school every day? Most days I can't even find a reason to get out of bed. Oh my God. Stop, stop, stop. I don't want to cry. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, why eat? Why make friends? I'm gonna stop reading it out loud or I actually will start crying. <laughs> oh my god. Whew. I'm in shock. I'm in shock too. Holy crap. Now I understand her poem a lot more with the bottles. That was, that was rough. Man, maybe you guys weren't as close as you thought you were. Or she's just really good at pretending. 
Don't want to get up, just want to lay in bed all day with my virtual friends. Well, I'm glad at least you would have a support system. Unless you're talking about NPCs. <laughs> Wait a minute, go back. It almost feels like I've been betrayed as your close friend. Literally, someone comes out to you and says they have horrible depression and the very first thing you're gonna say is that you betrayed me as your close friend. I'm mad. I'm mad. That is, that is stupid. That is a stupid thing to say. Talking about Twitch chat. Oh, okay, good. Yes. <laughs> Literally! That, it makes me mad because like he's me in the game and like I don't want to say that. I would never say that. And now you're just like grasping for sympathy. Like what? Do you want her to apologize to you for not coming out about her depression? What is this? At least I'm mad instead of sad now. <laughs> Why do you think I didn't tell you? Aw, oh, thank you, Cloud, for the host. I really appreciate it. Oh my god. I don't want to be cared about. Stop it. Stop it. Now I want to start the game over and <laughs> become Sayuri's boyfriend. <laughs> Oh my god. Don't laugh when you say that. I never talk about depression to my friends. You don't want to make other people carry your burden. Dude, that's so rough. And I'm sorry to hear that. I hope like hanging out and talking brings you some joy. Cause that's so hard. Stop! No! It's spear! No! I don't want to be the cause of her sadness. I don't understand your feelings at all, but I don't need to understand. No, my god, I hate this game, you guys. <laughs> I don't like this game anymore. You're a very nice person. <laughs> You're a very nice person. I'm really glad you can be here. And I'm glad if it helps a little bit. I finally showed you what a horror- You're not a horrible person! Oh god, now she's crying. <laughs> Dang it! <sighs> I hate this. I'm just weak and selfish. That's all I am. That's why I'm going to accept these punishments. Cause I just <laughs> can't believe. You know what? I take it back. I. Why did you make me play this game? <laughs> this is awful. This is the worst. <laughs> We're gonna shake her again. <laughs> what are you saying? Pain. Thanks for the pain. <laughs> I know. Stab me through the heart and get it over with. I'm really happy you convinced me to join the club. Seeing you every day makes it worthwhile enough. <laughs> Shakes her out of depression. <laughs> yeah, right? Next time your friend is depressed, just shake them. Please never underestimate how much I care about you. Shaking baby syndrome. <laughs> oh my god. Never shake a baby. Sayuri isn't hugging me back. Oh man. Oh, man. Oh, my God. Please.
please don't do this. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. I'll make these feelings go away. I mean, that's not really something you should say to someone with depression. That's not really fair. But I, I like the sentiment. I don't know. That's the, that's the hardest thing. I don't know. Like, this sucks. <laughs> Freaking hey, this game sucks so much. <sighs> Brittany uses her baby's head as an ashtray. <laughs> I've never seen that, but that sounds awful. And that sounds very family guy like. This game sucks, but it's also good. Such is life, Funky Frog. My god. Your hugs are so warm. And that's really scary too. Life is for all the coaster, blah blah. Yep. How would you like for me to spend it all with you? Oh god. I don't I don't know about this though, like you can't just find out your friend has depression and then be like, Hey, I'll date you so you won't have depression anymore, you know? Like, oh god, this is tough. If I could spend the whole day here, I would. It sucks because like we literally could have chosen to spend the day with her, but we didn't. Do you want to come be a third wheel between me and my current girlfriend? Yeah, I figured as much. I'd date my friend who's a girl out of pity better than than being deceased. I... Like, I get the sentiment, but... Uh, it's so tough. Yeah, yikes. I'm trying my hardest. It is a toughie. But honestly, like, if if our character here can find a way to be there for her in a real honest way, then that's fine. But I feel like he's having trouble finding that balance right now, so... Focus on what's ahead of me. Did only find out a few minutes ago. Find out what? Oh my god. <gasps> She's so pretty! Oh my god, look at that sweater. <sighs> Things are upbeat again. <laughs> the depression thing. I think it's a path. Yeah, sweater girl. I only just found out about the depression. Nobody answered the doorbell. Okay, so kind of confirmed that nobody else is living there, maybe? That is a huge flippin' house for one person, though. Soulmates exist without being together. Yeah, right? Actually, that's really true. I truly a thousand percent believe that, Funky Frog. You can have non-romantic soulmates. Oh, I get to 
to see his room. <gasps> I'm excited. All right, let's look around. What do we have? I see some games, I think. Some binders, a lot of binders. Who has that many binders? There's nothing interesting in this room. I cleaned it before you came over, but you couldn't stack up your books. A lot of books, shocking. The girls can help me clean my room. Don't look in there! What's in the drawer? What the heck was in the drawer? Do you have like a porn drawer? It's not even gonna explain it. Now I'm curious. She's wearing a pretty reserved sweater. <laughs> I mean, to be fair, I don't think she came over here to do anything like, like that. It's where he keeps all his, his dongles. <laughs> it's all the drug money, what? What? His Yuri, ha <laughs> ha. Very funny. Mood lighting, aromatherapy can. Ooh, wow. If any club had cupcakes and aromatherapy candles and mood lighting, I'd sign up. I don't care what it is. I don't care if it's identifying rocks. I would join that club. Show me the necky kaneki. <laughs> Cupcakes. <laughs> That's great. Look at her neck. Oh my god, you guys. You see like a centimeter of skin and you lose your minds. Intense. so sweet. Let me see them ankles. Relax. What did she bring? What? She literally brought scented candles to my room? <laughs> Who does that? You guys are so odd. Cover the windows in black paper and use the candles to light them for what? What? Who does that? Diffuser? I mean, it sounds amazing, but <laughs> goth girlfriend, literally. Black out the windows and burn candles? She doesn't want that, but she brings scented candles. Yeah, right? Positive energy, romance, reflection. It's almost like a magic. Thin ray of vapor begins to spout through a small hole on the top. I love aromatherapy stuff. I love scented candles. I love anything that gives off good smells. 